Express sewer and drain, we're at 2225 Zinfandel Drive, performing a TV inspection through a roof vent. Roof vent is constructed with uh, three inch asbestos cement. Pipeline transitions to cast iron. So far, cast iron seems to be in fairly good condition. Five foot three, we're entering into a small belly. Looks like the pipe on the sides has a little bit of a, uh, a scale buildup. This appears to be a clean out that was installed. I'm going to go ahead and locate. I have located this area and marked it out with chalk paint right in front of the garden bed. Um, why is there water running? Oh, never mind. That's from the belly. So I located that area. I did not. I, I poked around with my screwdriver right there, and I did not feel the clean-out riser. So it's probably buried a little bit. It'll just need to be dug up. But I put chalk paint there. And right here at 43 foot 8, we have a pile of debris along with roots. I was able to get past that section. You can see the roots growing downwards. And the roots are following the bottom of the pipeline. They call this a foxtail. It grows down towards the main. Uh, this, this section of pipeline is constructed with uh, four inch asbestos cement. Uh, 54 foot two, we've got another root intrusion. Another root intrusion at 62. Pipe transitions to ABS. That right there is the county clean out. You can see it in the 12 o'clock position. Uh, you see that hole in the top of the pipe. That's the riser access for the county clean out. So everything from that point 
forward is a county portion of pipeline. Uh, due to the fact that my camera is binding up, um, going through all these bends, as you can see, I'm having to, to uh, jab at it. We're not going to continue to push forward uh, because the uh, responsibility of that portion of pipeline is on the county anyways. So from here, we're going to go ahead and pull backwards, and this will be the end of the inspection.